Want to copy the looks from your favorite show? Beauty expert Anika Elliott is going to show us how. Good morning. Hi, Annette. Good to see you. And yes, I know there's so many things that we're watching right now, especially if so many of us are at home. And so I've got you covered. I want to start off, though, with a product that I love to use before makeup. And this is from Aveeno. This is their Calm and uh, Restore collection. All these products have the super ingredient of oat. So there's a cleanser, there is a serum, and then there's an oat gel. No fragrance or parabens, phthalates. Uh, it's... um also no dyes and that's a great product to use as i mentioned before these makeup looks to give you a nice clean supple look it removes a lot of redness and any irritation and uh, you can pick that up at shoppers drug mart it is uh, 35.99 so that's a great way to start particularly good for this first show which is Bridgerton. Oh, our the looks favorite. from Bridgerton. <laughs> the makeup is fabulous. The clothing and, and the oh. sets that they have, right? It's, wow. Perfect. 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 Regency era. I know, so romantic, especially that character Daphne you've seen there in that light blue. She has very minimal makeup, almost like a, 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 a supple, dewy look, but also blushed cheeks, very yes. flushed. Yes. And so a great way to achieve that is with a nice cream blush. I like a cream brush blush from Rare Beauty, like these little products here, very cute. You just put it on the apples of your cheeks and then blend it out. And I find it looks very much like skin so very natural get that at sephora 27 dollars goes a long way okay what's our next show then that we're going to emulate okay euphoria this is one for the younger folks this is uh, starring Zendaya, and it's about, you know, just young people navigating um, ups and downs, trials and tribulations. They do a lot of um, fairy-like makeup, I should say, lots of glitters and sequins and so forth. So if sequins a little too much for you, I love a product like this one from Pixie and uh, Makeup by Denise. It's a collaboration. It's a highlighter palette. So you've got a bunch of different shades here, nine, and you can use them together or by themselves. You can use the highlighter on your lid, on the inner corner of your eye, which is what they do a lot on the show, or on the lower lid as well. And then, of course, they do a lot of highlighted cheeks. This is a multi-purpose product that I love, 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 and I'm wearing it right now. I, I was going to say the highlights on your cheeks look amazing. <laughs> yes, so that's a perfect way to, to do Euphoria. Also, at Shoppers Drug Mart, in store or online, twenty four ninety nine goes a long way. Okay, and mm -hmm. you can use that, yeah, multi purpose there. What's our next look? Yes. Okay, so the show Queen's Gambit. I don't know if you've seen that one on Netflix. It's about the child um, chess prodigy. Yes, I'm obsessed with this. It's a limited series and shot in Hamilton. It's a lot of. Oh, yes, that's true. I yeah. forgot that. 50s and 60s looks. And she did a lot of mod looks as well, but very much well known for the bold red lip and a winged liner. Oh, I was obsessed with her wing liner. To achieve that, you can use Marcel Cosmetics Double Precision Liquid Liner Pen. It's great for control. It's got two different sizes. And I love the thinner side for a nice sharp edge. You make a little triangle at the outer corner of your eye and then you connect it after the fact. That's how I do it. The lip color is from Bougie Cosmetics. It's a Canadian brand. This particular one on the left uh, is Justice. And I thought that was a really good dupe, as the kids say, for, uh, <laughs> the, uh, for the colors that they use on the show. You know. <laughs> very good, very good. And then our last look. This now, WandaVision from Disney Plus. Oh, yes. This is yes. about following the lives of, yes, those Marvel superheroes of the same name, actually. And it's a lot in the 50s, so this sort of a, a Pleasantville look. And, you know, her hair is really nice, the coiffed red look, even that character as well. You start with a really nice blowout, and then you want to pin curl it. So basically taking your, your hair and wrapping it around in a sort of a curl, and then pinning it up after the fact like that you know once you before you do that use a, a, a blow dryer like quo beauty's tourmaline a ceramic blow dryer and that'll give you a nice clean blowout and then you can style it after that so some of my favorite shows hopefully you have fun trying these things out and um yeah fun stuff fun to do at this. home while we're watching yeah. while we're streaming everything anika great yes. to see you again thank you you too take care